decision making under uncertainty without probability saying if you want to today under our control if you want to take a decision between to manufacture a product to buy local as domestic or to buy it from abroad as imported so today decision is under our control but the future state value which is the state of nature outside of our control is going to happen one time in the future okay it's going to happen in the future saying the fact there's no probability there is no estimation or forecast what the future said is going to be in the future so we're going to use different criteria in order to help us to make a decision if you're being extremely op optimistic the first one is maxi max criteria this maximum of the maximum condition to be expected the maximum or the best condition or we being very optimistic is high sales okay and so in a way today we're going to decide and we're being very optimistic that the sale is going to be extremely high so the maximum value is 55 and the value using will be to manufacture okay using the maximax the maximum so this one is the maximax the maximum uh, today decision is under our control we're being extremely pessimistic so we expect the state of nature which is outside of our control is going to happen in the future to be extremely pessimistic so the sale is going to be extremely low so the best condition the maximum out of the worst it might have is 10 so the solution is to buy abroad okay Minimax regret criterion is to minimize the maximum regret. Let's see how it works. Okay. So I'm gonna show you those two tables. So I've already did them. Saying if today we decide to buy abroad and at a certain period of time the sales turn out to be low but we already decided to buy abroad so the payoff is ten dollar or ten thousand dollars so we have no regret like because we already did the best decision but however if we did decide to manufacture today and the sales turn out to be low after a period of time so we always have a regret like saying what if we we did choose to buy abroad so the regret here instead of losing minus 15 of losing 15 we could have made 10,000 so regret is 25 and as I said if we decide to buy abroad and the sale turn out to be low so this is the first best decision so regret is zero and the same applies here so if we decide to buy domestic and the sale turn out to be low we could always say oh we wish we did buy from abroad so the regret is five as it's the same way with that medium and the high for every decision we calculate the maximum regret so here is 25 we put it here here is 30 we, we put the value here and here is 10 we put the value here okay so we have 25 30 and 10 as a maximum regret okay uh, so oh excuse me so here is 55 minus 14 is 40 is 15 as a maximum regret so for every decision and we want to minimax the criterion to minimize the regret to minimize the maximum regret so the best the minimum out of the maximum regret is to buy domestic so this is a buy domestic is using minimax regret criteria okay uh, the next video i'm gonna show how to do the equally likely and how to do the expected value based on probability distribution okay thank you
and the videos and next video link are available in the box below